for me, when I made the decision to fly into China right at the start of the pandemic, it was the best decision I ever made in my life. Because if I would have stayed in England, I would have been stuck in a first lockdown, a second lockdown, a third lockdown. 这位有感而发的小哥是英国视频博主杰森，目前居住在中国贵州省。五月六号，杰森在 YouTube 网分享了自己五一假期在中国旅游的视频，仅一天时间就获得近四千个赞。从河北德明古镇到山西汽口古镇，杰森感受到了这个小长假的轻松惬意。People are not worried. People are relaxed. People are enjoying this holiday here. It's May May holiday.、Um, I mean, look at this. Other countries around the world are still either in lockdown or they're just coming out of lockdown. 在杰森看来，中国很多省份已经实现零感染，民众能尽情享受假期。这是中国史无前例的疫情防控举措赢得的宝贵财富。It's unprecedented how China handled this, especially when they're a country this size, when with this amount of people, 1.4 billion people. There's no other country you can compare them to even. If you were to compare them to another country, I guess you'd have to look at India,、um, which also has a billion people、uh, in their country. And unfortunately, at the moment, you know, India's not doing too well. A lot of countries around the world are also sending aid to India, and also China is too. 那么，中国取得抗疫胜利的秘诀是什么呢？杰森认为，关键在于快。Well, it was a multitude of factors.、Um, their track and trace system. Everyone uses it on their phone, on WeChat. Their, their speed at which they can they can set things up, they can set up testing centers and temporary hospitals. Generally, they're just quicker at everything. 然而，杰森也提到，令人遗憾的是，西方媒体鲜少报道中国在疫情防控方面的成效。西方还有一些人总是戴着有色眼镜看中国，但在杰森看来，眼见才为实。I literally saw this with my own eyes here. I saw it on the ground here. 